Alright, so we're back more percent of three. Last time we de we defeated the lovers, but also the hero fought uh full moon boss. So now we're kinda just chilling. A new spot uh Tartarus has opened up, so we'll definitely be taking a look at that. I think we can do it today because we're not tired. I don't remember. Oh no, we're considered six right now. <laughs> well, you know, maybe uh, may maybe later in the video we'll see. But uh, yeah, I definitely got to get rid of the sickness. That is a that's a big old no. Especially if I can pass it off to the others like that is a, because apparently that's the thing. So let's definitely make sure that doesn't happen. I think I need more book covers for the one lady on off chance. I mean, if we end up hitting Tartar soon anyways, we have plenty of money at the moment, but on the off chance, we'll go ahead and grab some. Alright, we'll hit up the doctor guy. Worst comes the worst if he uh, if he makes it so we end up skipping uh, the morning time here. We'll just go ahead and uh, just hopefully sleep off the sickness. He says the same thing every time, at least I've seen so far. Yeah, he just says the same thing every time. Well, I'm sick, so I can't get worse than I am right now, right? Your condition doesn't seem to be any bad. But I survived, so it works. You know, that's a free courage upgrade, I'll take it. Alright, so we're sick right now. If we go... If we go, like, to the uh, rejuvenation area, I'm pretty sure we could fix the sickness. The question is uh, whether or not we actually want to or not. So it's 7.10 in the times. So I'm pretty sure last time we saw uh, Elizabeth had got a new quest. In which case, let me just make sure before I uh, advance the day here, potentially. Alright, so that's all the old stuff. This should be, yeah, it's from the new block. Three Opal, you also have forever to do it. Pretty sure Opal we needed for a lot of the better stuffs. Uh, we still need to make him at some point. We can already make him. I just don't know who has Dodge Slash and who doesn't. As soon as I can get somebody with Dodge Slash, we can make that happen. Treat the fourth document. We got plenty of time for these so far. Like to listen to a song that is associated with your school. Raglan t-shirt. Okay, presumably that's like a costume or something. We have infinite time to do it, so we don't have to worry about it. So really, all we have here is... Uh, is Tartarus stuff. At least on to, in terms of like... Uh, Time related quest. Personas, is there anybody we're ready to get rid of to Kaja? That'll be nice when we actually get that. Nullifying all the stat bonuses. We have Dodge Strike. So close, but it's not Dodge Slash. You, I mean, honestly, we could just use, use the thing. We could. And we might, especially since our magicians are maxed out. But I mean, 32 magic. If that's not including our. Uh, our trinkets and whatnot, we're looking at probably close to like 40 magic on a level 25. That's pretty insane. Uh, Pale Rider, we still got plenty of time for him. Uh, you have a heart, so we got to keep you for the time being. You've also got a heart. Uh, Jack Frost, we can get out of the way. He's also a magician, so we can just throw him away. Fortune, we do need for somebody. Justice, we need. Big Snake also has a heart, so we should keep him. Aries can also go. Aries and Jack Frost can get out of here, though I don't think we'll really be able to make anything all too well with them. Uh, do we have any quest on us right now that I'm still doing? Retrieve the lead metal, retrieve the hump. The Humunculus? Yeah, that'll be in there. Go feed the cat. We've had it once so far, will you? Uh, but it's kind of like the cat in four, I guess, where we have to feed it multiple times on multiple different days sort of thing. So this should be at least attempt number two feeding it. Cats literally start the 
Gav's purring loudly, it seems happy. The purring seems louder than did the other day. If you come back and feed it some more, it might get help. Great. All right, we can try the restroom trick, see? All right, so, no, no, well, somebody seems to be cleaning that one. Okay, then, well, then we'll just go back to the school, I guess. Pretty sure there was a bathroom on the second floor as well, but I'm watching. Yeah, now it's on the second floor. Ah, well, thank you so much. Alright, so we tried the doctor. We're gonna try the restroom. We're trying all the free ways of getting rid of the sickness, though I don't know. You're not feeling so well. Well, you know. It's given us great condition before, so it can't hurt to try, right? All right, so we gotta get rid of this sickness because uh, going in the Tartarus while being sick sounds like an absolutely horrible idea. We'll go ahead and check around the town since we finished the uh, full moon in case there's anything new as a result. Uh, I saw a girl in a frilly, white frilly dress the other day in front of the store. You shouldn't, don't get me wrong, I love that kind of outfit. I got tons of figures dressed that way in my room, kind of stuff. In real life, I think it's better than dress cash. Okay. So, dude, what kind of dance is popular nowadays in the clubs? Reggae? That rap junk? In my day, it was the tango and the jitterbug. You danced with your girl not to show off. I fell in love at first sight with my wife at one of those halls. Alright, old man, give times. Yeah, yeah, Ms. Sears family owns this place. I heard from my son that there's this free keep website on the internet. Apparently, you can have someone carry out revenge. Have online revenge agents now? I know about computers, but that does sound strange. You know, just a little strange. Nobody's missing. Oh, I guess we can always delay Tartarus until people go missing and then go in so that way I can get them all at once while also finishing up the quest. That would make more sense. Policeman might have new stuff for us, but I'm pretty sure we checked him like right after the time rolled over, so it's probably fine. So we're just gonna take a quick little look. The conversation died again, I keep sweating. Is it because of the heat, or is this a cold sweat? He's sweating a lot now, but he's usually not like this. That type of guy is pretty popular with all the ladies who work here. Everybody remembers his face, I'm surprised to be honest. It's amazing how many people say hello to him at shops. The victims of apathy syndrome can never get their normal lives. Okay, have we heard that one for sure? A movie... A movie's theme song is very important. The quality of the movie is greatly affected by whether its theme song is any good or not. Which reminds me, long ago I heard there was going to be a GeckuCon theme song. I think it was called GeckuCon Boogie or something like that. I heard it was nearly done. I want to hear how it turned out, but I wouldn't want a traditional song for a theme. So, in theory, we might be able to talk to this guy in order to be able to get the uh, theme. The station near the high school, so I often spot the students and their friends. You seem to be alone a lot. Do you have any friends? <laughs> I have plenty. I wish I did. I don't need it. Great. I wish I had some friends when I was in school. Rip. I wish I did, but I suggest you make friends now. The longer you wait in life, the harder it'll be. I need friends. Well, that's the person. Do what you want. Ah, oh, come on, man. Anything new? I doubt walking around we'll see those three, but maybe. Yeah, I can't do anything with the cat right now. Can't go in there. Looks like those three weirdos have been snooping around here. Guess they're trying to hear the juicy stuff. The stuff you can't find out of how normal life. The whole reason I hang out here is to shoot the shit with my butts. Those three weirdos are the only ones who come here to learn anything. They need to get a light. Okay, so clearly they frequent that area, yet we've never actually seen them, which is more than likely on purpose. Uh, Takayaki. I don't think I need to feed the girl at the shrine Takayaki every time I meet her, but I'll make sure I've got some on me just in case. I doubt after the first time he misses, yeah, I have like seven of them, so I think we'll be okay in that regard. My friend at school said there was a stray cat around here. I'm waiting here until he comes out. 
I'm not gonna catch him or anything, I just wanna see him, so I wonder what kind of cat he is. Uh, well, I'm almost done feeding him, I think. If you swirl seafood ramen around six times clockwise and six times the other way without spilling, if you do that with the ramen, I heard you can hook up with the person you like. <laughs> Sign me up! What was I thinking? Actually having to do something, just do that for him. Sweet job, right, that doesn't actually do anything, it just kind of exists. Much like the uh, manga store there. Check out the shrine in case anybody else is chilling here. Not looking like it. Alright, then. Alright, uh, we're gonna take this day to get rid of the sickness, unfortunately. I'd rather not put it. <laughs> After seeing what Tyre did to our party, I absolutely do not want to deal with sickness. Anyone tired will feel great, anyone alright. Feel great. Uh, go in as a customer. Yeah, because that's gonna be able to pay. What if I go into the park to see? Maybe he'll, he'll be like, oh, you're sick, and give me something. Hot. I doubt there's anything that outright fixes sickness. Nope. Alright then. Alright, we'll take it on the off chance that it fixes sickness. I highly doubt it. I'll probably need this plus going to sleep early. Currently I have a cold. Unfortunately, colds cannot be cured. Well, okay then. Screw me, I guess. Well. Well, I'm not going back to the door, really. That just sounds like absolute. Did I talk to the people out here? I'm, you know. The revenge quest. Yeah, we heard that. Waiting for your boyfriend. She's still stalking him, of course she is. Which, of course, you know, is only only an option for the ladies. You know, if a dude was ever like this, just straight to jail. I'm so, I'm so used to her stalking me now, I didn't even realize she's around anymore. And this seems to be having the exact opposite effect of what you want here, lady. But you know what? You do you. Who can I, who can I talk to on Friday? I don't remember. We maxed out you, and we maxed out Kenji. Uh, the old cop, the old couple, we could pretty much do whatever. Swim team, I don't think. Uh, we can do the swim team if we want. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Hermit's just Sundays and va uh, vacations. Fortune is Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Alright, so we have basically the swim team. Gold couple. Uh, of course, we can't bring his up because we can upgrade baby. Or we can upgrade the food game. Frequent small all week but Thursday. So we can leave Gourmet King for a while since we can rank his up more or less whenever. Kind of like with the old couple. In which case, it would be more so Bebe or the Swim Team. Uh, do I have a persona for either one of these guys? Why Why I feel like the answer is no here. Well, I can switch out Jack Frost. That's not really much of an issue. Oh, we have Ares. Yeah, this works. Alright, I guess we'll do the Swim Team for once in our life. <laughs> why not? Alright. You on the practice today? Yeah. Yeah, why not? It takes dedication, but no one's more dedicated than me. Let's go. All right, we'll see about that. Gekkon High School indoor swimming pool. The swim team is giving it everything they got. The workout is tough. But fun. My side is killing me. Don't overdo it. Tough enough. Oh man. I mean, clearly he's a teammate, right? So it's tough enough. Get good. All right. Oddly enough, he seems happy. Surprisingly, that wasn't the best one. And because, you know, that easily could have gone one way or another. How about you? You okay? You've been pushing the pace. You don't, look, you don't even look tired. What kind of training have you been doing? The usual special training. You know, he wants to hear about this. That's what I thought, or else I wouldn't be like this. You're crazy. This sucks. You destroyed me. Wow, okay. We didn't get anything from it. That might have just been like a non-you-can't-really-get-points. 
or maybe I could have said the usual and uh, played it off like that, but that might have triggered it more. I knew the Bay Area competition would be tough, but I never expected to be going up against someone like you. I made up my mind, one day I'm gonna beat you. I mean, you know, good luck to you and all that. Alright, swim team rank to you. Sorry, I shouldn't get so worked up over it. Let's go. What's up, hurry? It, no, well, we know what it is. It's this like, Hurry up. My knee. I think I twisted. Oh, sorry. Let's go. I, I feel like there was only like one actual time I could have gotten points there, but okay. I see you go, do I? Talk to her and keep walking. And, uh, what's up, manager lady? What you do? Uh, that's what I was saying. Wanna walk home together? See you tomorrow. Uh, walk home together? Nah, I'm in a hurry today. Alright, well. Subdued. I better go say, since exams are coming up. Rip. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna be able to study either because I'm sick. Rip. It's okay to reflect on your victory, but there are exams next week and you should focus on yeah, yeah, okay, you go, we know, yeah, I'm not gonna use any of those commands, are you insane? I mean, maybe we could do a run where we did, like, uh, I can't control anything and just let the computer YOLO it if people really want to see it. Our next story concerns a very rare event, Miraculous Flower, which only blooms once every 100 years is blooming. It seems to be responding to the other strange events in town. Right. Alright, well, I guess we're going straight to sleep, because studying while I'm sick is just not going to work. You know, very much the like of real life, huh? Exams are nearly here and you're tired. Uh, yeah, no, I'm uh, I'm actually sick, apparently. <laughs> Rips of that day. Feels bad. You're no longer sick because you rested. Alright, you know what? Worth it? I mean, I don't know how bad sick really is, but I imagine it probably screws over. Because I said I could pass it to others, right? In which case, maybe that would make others unavailable for my run through, which while we did a little bit solo, I don't know if I want to do a whole new block solo. That's a, whew, that's a little spicy. Uh, exams are pretty soon. Have you been studying? Nah, seriously? Like I care. All right, Junpei, you're going to be like this now because of that last fight. I see it. There we go. Finally, we're up to Ty Tyra no Mazzucato, the turning point of the era of the same. It all began from infighting among the Tyra. Tyra? Probably. Their conflict escalated until the Imperial Court intervened. Mazzucato was pursued by the Imperial Court and had no choice but to openly oppose them. The result was known as the War of Mazzucato. You don't look at anything like a samurai, but let's see if you know this. What title did he claim for himself? <laughs> King, Emperor, Prince, or Crusade? Hmm. Imperial Court. I mean, if you're gonna, if you're gonna go like that. Right? It's gotta be key. Wrong, he called him the Prince of Cold, but I was thinking it was one of the two. This will be on the exam next week, so be prepared. Let's get forward a little to the Kamamura era. The samurai's presence begins to be felt in history. In 1192, the Kamakura Shogun was established. Yes, we're there. And of course, his founder was Minamoto no. I can't believe we're finally here. Your answer was incorrect. Because I'm supposed to know? Apparently. You don't look like a samurai. Let me ask you questions about being a samurai. Oh, okay. Oh, you got it wrong? Oh, I can only imagine as to why. It's from Akihiko. He's coming tonight. He has something to tell us. We'll meet on the fourth floor as soon as everyone's back. Great. Alright, well, Saturday. Problems a lot harder than midterms, you know, but that doesn't mean I'll study harder. We'll see. Sometimes the extra effort pays off. We'll see about that. It's almost time for exams again. This time it'll be a lot tougher. You better go to the library to study, otherwise you'll be screwed. I'm like freaking bored studying. I think I'll be okay. Oh, there's that revenge website. Yeah. Uh, nobody's going to want to meet because exams are soon. 
Okay, hers was different. I was walking around the other day and this weird guy walked up to me. He didn't wear a shirt and he had weird tattoos. I tried to look away, but I accidentally looked right into his eyes. They were the coldest eyes I ever seen and then he smiled. Uh, even thinking about it gives me shivers all down my back. If only it had been Mitsuru, I would have painted on the spot. Alright, you know Mitsuru Sims. Uh, stay wooden, apparently. I don't care. I don't know or care about that ghost stuff, but I wish I could ask them why they're spreading that. I mean, they're dead. They shouldn't be bothering the living people. The couple's only apathy syndrome that's been going around. I heard it was the work of ghosts. They say that a couple committed double. Uh, well, can't say that. Uh, I'm sure YouTube would not approve of that, so let's not. A lot of time ago. And now they're infecting couples with apathy Believe me, I would love to be able to talk for you, but uh, YouTube is, uh, is not a fan of certain words. And, uh, well, you know, that just happens to be one of them, unsurprisingly. My body's in average condition. You know what? I'm not sick at Inside, I'm good. Okay, I'm good. Turns out we're good. When I think of artists, I think of the people who squint and hold pencil up to their subject. Artists who do that, especially the guys who just want to look. Okay, then. Heard there's a revenge website, but the URL is top secret, right? I'm trying to figure it out, so I'm looking all over the web on myself. There's a local broadcasting area that seems like it has a lot of info on the site, but it's all garbage. Ah, well, who could have seen that one? Kenji, how you doing? Exams aren't too far away, so I'm going straight home today. Studying in the library is just too boring. At home, I can watch TV while I study. Yep, yep, study. Alright, what are our social status like at the moment? We're confident, we're determined, and we're smart. No. Sam's are right around the corner. You've been studying, there's no shortcut to success, persistence, and key. And even if you study every day, it, it takes time to see results. Oh, don't. You don't have to tell me about this, Mr. I noticed, you know, when I had the study, what, a week in a row straight? And I still didn't even get an upgrade in academics? Yeah. You won't learn anything by cramming at the last minute. Why don't you stay at the library when you have the time? How about no? Alright, is there anybody? Uh, we might be able to hang out with the whole couple right now. Alright, we talked to all the NPCs since so changing over to the new set, so it should be okay to there. We talked to Nozomi if we want, that's an option. We do have the snake, so we could get that uh, upgraded slightly faster as a result. I goes here. I do have hang on me. Uh, she's staring at me. All right, sure, why not? She seems relieved as tears are run down her face. I can't handle it anymore. Mom and Dad just keep fighting. I yelled at them the police stop fighting so much, but they just told me to leave them alone. So I made up my mind, I have to run away from home. Don't do anything hasty, calm down, sounds like a plan. What you would actually say, but you know she's not gonna hear it. What? Slightly better, this is just... <laughs> this is just being a bad influence. Uh, don't do anything hasty. What, but I thought you were on my side. I'm going to run away, I already made up my mind, I better stop. start packing. So what do you think I need to pack if I'm running away from home? I need lots of snacks, right? What about my health insurance? That should be enough. It'll take more than that. But I don't know what else I should bring. Okay, what else? Maybe my PJs or my toothbrush? What else? Either way, I'm going to try. Don't worry, I'm going to be just fine, okay? I'm going to miss you, though. It won't be easy to be alone. Were there any good, uh, I mean, I guess the only thing I could think of is saying sounds like a plan, which I guess would have been the right way to be in order to agree with her, but. Once I run away, mom and dad will have to work together to fly me. It's gonna be great. It takes a lot of hard work to get ready to run away. I mean, I suppose that's one way of doing it. The dormitory command Mitsuru gave an accounting of the battle at the hotel to this. So that's what happened on the night of the 7th. 
It was a difficult operation. I see. They're getting tougher. But it's not all bad news. I called today's meeting because... Okay. I'm sorry. Before we go on, I'd like to ask Mitsuru oh Senpai boy. something. Here we go. Me? Since I've joined, so many things have happened. You knew it was going to come out at one point or another. Let's see how this turns out, shall we? I went along with it without really understanding what was going on. But now I need to know. Oh. I'm going to ask you straight out. Okay. You've been hiding something from us, haven't you, Senpai? Uh, the thing that we've all been noticing but haven't said out loud. You act like you don't know anything about the Dark Hour and Tartarus. Ooh. But they're related to that accident ten years ago, aren't they? What accident? Yukari-chan! There was an explosion near our school, and a lot of people died. We've heard this. It must this. have been big news back then. You know about it, don't you? Yes. Got it. Luckily, no students were injured. But... I've, a lot of people died, but also no students were injured. Yeah, that's pretty convenient. Around the same time, a large number of students were recorded as absent. Sounds sus to me. Seems like more than just a coincidence. What do you mean? I dug up some old school records and found something interesting. The students who were absent, they all collapsed suddenly and had to be hospitalized. Oh, you mean like something along the lines of, uh, apathy syndrome? Sound familiar? You know, like the girls who bullied Fuka. Ooh. There has to be an explanation. What really happened on the day of that accident? The Kirijo group built our school, so you must know something. Get her. Tell me the truth. I wasn't trying to hide anything from you. It just never seemed relevant. Coming from Mitsuru, I believe. But... It's okay. It's not your fault. All right. I'll tell you the whole story. Please do. Story time. The shadows have many mysterious abilities. We're aware. Some research indicates that they can even affect time and space. That's extremely concerning. But I suppose if you've seen our playthroughs in 4 or 5, that's not exactly something out of the realm of possibilities. We think of them as our enemies, but what if we could somehow use them to our advantage? Ah, yes, I'm sure that would go over well. They would be a source of unimaginable power, wouldn't they? This sounds like this can only lead to good things. What? Fourteen years ago, one man pursued that line of thinking. Your father! He was the former leader of the Kirijo group, Koetsu Kirijo. My grandfather. Ah, your grandfather. Oh, okay. Well, you know. My grandfather was obsessed with the shadows. He wanted to harness their power for something extraordinary. Like what? He assembled a team of top scientists, and over several years, he put together an impressive collection of shadows. A what? Damn, that's freaking crazy. However, ten years ago, during the final stages of the experiment, they lost control of the shadow's power. Okay. And in the process, the very nature of the world was altered. Good job. Oh my, do you mean... Yes, Tartarus and the Dark Hour. By their account, the mass of shadows they collected split into several large ones that then dispersed. These are the shadows we've been encountering on nights when the moon is full. Is that why they've appeared in different places? Wait a minute. Okay. If what you said is true, then why did our school turn into Tartarus? Well, where do you think they were doing the experiments, Yukari? Don't tell me. That's where they conducted the experiment? Yes. Then, those students who were hospitalized... I'm afraid it's just as you're thinking. Oof. Port Island must have been an ideal location for them. 
it was a highly populated area, and the Kirijo group had influence there. They could do as they pleased. As you guessed, the experiment 10 years ago was conducted at Gekukan High School. Does that mean all we've been doing is cleaning up their mess? Basically, yeah. You lied to us? I don't know if she necessarily lied. She just didn't tell us everything, in which case you could say the mission of the truth is then essentially lie in and of itself, which, you know, fair enough. You knew, too, didn't you, senpai? They've just been using us. Or do you not care as long as you get to fight? Ooh. I never said anything like that. I have my reasons. Think what you'd like. It was my decision not to share that information. I'm sorry. I never intended to deceive you. And I believe... Convincing you to join C's was my highest priority. Which just, you know, happened to be for your biggest game, for sure. As absurd as it may seem, only we, with our personas, can fight the shadows. Yet yeah, you're able to contain shadows in that experiment to use their power. You know, something about that don't seem quite right. How could you? Besides, some of us were never given a choice. I... Mitsuru, don't. Yukari, it's those in the past who are to blame. And they lost their lives as a result of what they did. Did they? Did they, though? I don't know. It sounds like an accidental moment. We're all in the same boat here. None of us deserve the burden that's been thrust upon us. But... <sighs> It's been ten years since that incident. No one knows why those shadows suddenly returned. But since they're active, at least we can find and destroy them. Do you realize what this means? What if I told you that those twelve shadows are the cause of everything? I don't know if I'd believe. Then if we defeat them all, Tartarus and the Dark Hour will disappear? Again, another X the death. Exactly! I don't know, you're putting a lot of faith in this. That's what I was going to tell you earlier. See, it's good news, isn't it? Is that true? There's evidence to support it. Now, our true battle begins. He says after we killed, what, six of them? Like half of them now? I see. Regardless of what's happened in the past, we must fight to protect the people. Right. The shadows are gaining strength. We can't afford to just wait for them. You said as we've waited for the last six of them to show up? Indeed. And there are many mysteries still surrounding Tartarus. Why did such a gigantic structure appear in the first place? The answer must lie within it. You don't say. Hmm. must defeat the 12 shadows which start all of this in order to eradicate the dark hour targets. I mean, it still acts the doubt. I don't know. You must fight to protect the people. There are six left. I'm very sorry about everything. If there's anything you'd like to know about, please ask. 12 shadows. Yes, 10 years ago, a substantial number of shadows were consolidated into a single entity. Well, I'm sure that can only mean good things for us. Its power was immense, far greater than any of the shadows currently inside targets. Experiments were performed on it, and an unfortunate occurrence took place, combining the entity into 12 shadows. These shadows only appear during the full moon. On the public rank, in the end, over 50 people were injured in the accident. And the media placed full blame on the Kriju, the Kriju group for the tragedy. They singled out one researcher in particular, declaring him the main culprit behind it all. Whether this was actually true or not was not the issue. The public was looking for someone to vent their her and anger on, as they tend to do. So they chose him, even though he was the victim himself. The wrath was unparalleled. The darker side of humankind was most certainly on display during that time. Found Mitsu. 
Under the pretense that she was assisting the group, she was subjected to the experiment for years. So when Sarah wasn't born with the ability to summon a persona, she was forced to learn how. Okay, well that, that just by that admission, like throws out like half the logic of the game so far, but okay. Found Akihiko. I've known him and Mitsuru for a very long time. In fact, Akihiko joined us when he was only in middle school. At that time, we had a third member as well. By digress. Uh, yeah, you know, our th uh, the thug man himself. I don't think I need to tell you this, but we can't go to the Tartarus today. Hmm. Us? Well, since Junpei doesn't understand what's going on, I'm going to review it with him. But if we defeat all 12 shadows, then I won't have any more use for my persona. Man, it's such an amazing power, I can't let it go of the waste. He seems so calm, dude. Must be because he can do anything. No matter what happens, he can always protect himself, right? You're always so confident, I wish I could be like that. Junpei, the only thing anyone knows about Tartarus is that it creates shadows. Other than that, we're all in the dark. Everybody gets sent back to the rooms. Is that where we're at now? Sorry, I just don't feel like talking to anyone right now. Anyways, I have homework, so. I caused trouble for you. We shouldn't see each other for some time. Perhaps you should study. I'm about to review my notes now. So that thing actually helps to take your mind off things. Uh, you know, to a certain degree. Well, we can't go to the Tartarus anyways. So the question now becomes, do we want more studying or do we want different... A different stat increase here. Academics wise, we're smart. Charm and courage. Well, we can't really upgrade courage, can we? We can upgrade. Uh, well, we can't upgrade courage. Although it's the weekend, so it might be full. I think it was, what, like Saturday or Sunday that it said that karaoke was full? Saturday is the pharmacy is discounted, is that right? It is, although I'm not sure I necessarily need anything. I bought a bunch of stuff a long time ago. Yeah, no, we seem to be fine in that regard. Karaoke solo? Sure, let's get some courage. Why not? Courage is increased. We're getting there, slowly but surely. We're getting there. There's no school today. All daytime. Meanwhile, the port island back out. Nothing to do as usual, huh? Hey, the thug guy's gonna mm -hmm. be here. Sinjiro. <laughs> why are you here? You know why he's here, Sinjiro. If you came here to try and convince me, then forget it. It's nothing like that. I just wanted to see how you were doing. Huh? We've known each other for a long time. It's been almost 14 years since we met at the orphanage. At the orphanage, huh? No wonder why he joined the middle school, because he's an orphan. You, me, and Miki. We used to run around here until the sun went down. They might both potentially be orphans. Back then, it seemed like we had all the time in the world. <laughs> you haven't changed one bit. If you want to get all sappy, go do it with your other friends. Oh, get him. What was that? It's rare for you to think about the past. Usually, you just charge ahead like a damn fool. You got him. So obviously, there's something on your mind. I do reminisce sometimes, but what's the point? <sighs> anyway, we finally know how to get rid of Tartarus in the dark hour. No shit. Yeah. To be honest, all I've been thinking about lately is getting stronger. Oh, we've noticed. Don't worry. But yesterday, someone made me question my reason for fighting. Oh, Akihiko got shaken after that. Huh? Your reason for fighting, huh? 
cuts different for every person. But if you don't have a good one, you can always quit. Like I did. Ooh. I'm not like you. Oh, got him. Man, I can't believe I'm the one getting lectured here. Mm -hmm. Well, see you around. <laughs> you haven't changed at all. Meanwhile, in Fuga's room at the dormitory. Oh, my. Yes? Can I talk to you for a moment? Senpai? Oh, please come in. Not only do you excel at providing support during battle, but also at obtaining information. <laughs> oh, I I'm sorry for doing that without permission. Don't worry, you're not in trouble, but I do have a special favor to ask of you. I want you to find out as much as you can about that incident ten years ago. But very little was made public. That's why I want you to access the Kirijo Group's database. What, is she Futaba now? You mean hack into their system? That's illegal. Oh, really, Fuka? Is that what we're concerned about right now? I'll give you my ID and password. You'll be free from accountability. I want to know the truth in detail. Senpai. Of course, I'll understand if you refuse. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Are you sure? I appreciate it. Yamagishi, aren't you resentful? No, I was After confused. all, despite my good intentions, I did drag you into this without fully explaining. Certainly, you must be a little angry with me. Not really. You see, my parents have an inferiority complex because all my relatives are doctors. Okay, I can see how that can lead to that. That's why they're so tough on me. It's really hard for me to be at home. Makes sense. But here, I feel important, and I can help you and the others. So why should I be angry? You're right, Yamagishi. We do need you. No one can take your place. Uh, um. Oh my, Blush and Fuka. Thank you. I'll see you later. Oh my, Fuka, calm down. Meanwhile, in front of the Port Island Station. So, Tartarus and the Dark Hour will be gone, huh? That's right, Junpei. That's good. Uh, you don't seem so convinced anymore, That's Junpei. what we've been fighting for. But... Right. So why am I so pissed? Yeah. Gosh, it's hot. Even for July. Seriously. But at least we're seniors now. We won't be wearing these stupid uniforms much longer. Yeah, I've had enough of this. I just want to get accepted to college and start having some fun. Oh, yes, because college is so, so much fun. I mean, it was pretty, it was pretty average, obviously. I mean, it was just high school, but slightly harder. At least my experience, but then I also picked STEM, so of course it was going to be harder for him, but yeah. Hmm. <laughs> I know why. I'm the reason. I was like, fighting is my duty, but hell, it's all I'm good for. Rip Junpei? If it weren't for that, it'd be worthless. Aw, Junpei, you can't think <laughs> like that. My duty. What a bunch of bullshit. Hey, you're being a real Sajira right now. I can't fight worth shit anyway. Not compared to him, at least. Ah, uh, well, you know what they say. Comparison is the thief of joy. And, uh, well, you're kind of robbing yourself of that by trying to compare yourself to me. I've, the, I've got the plot armor. I'm truly just built different. So, like, I don't know why you do this to yourself. Damn it. Nothing I do is good enough. Well, know that feeling. <sighs> All too well. Meanwhile, in your car, is room at the dormitory. <sighs> oh, my car. Seems like my worst fears keep coming true. Am I stupid to believe in things like trust and friendship? Not necessarily, just, you know, depending on who you trust Dad, after. Oh. This old letter of yours. We must have read it a thousand times since it came last spring. 
Okay. March 6th, 2000. To my family. Tomorrow, I bring this letter to the opening ceremony for the Moonlight Bridge. Is this not just Akihiko's voice actor? It'll be stored in a time capsule and sent to you ten years from now. Yukari, you're so small right now, but in ten years, you'll be 16. You'll be in high school. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> I know you've been sad because I have to work so late, but you still always greet me with a smile. Very much so, given Persona 4 Dojima not go vibes right now. I'm really proud of myself. Karijo san appointed me head researcher. Oh no. Oh no. Hmm, one person that had to take all the blame for the experiments, really. And you know it's never the top people, because it, you know, it never is. So, uh, hmm. A person that they can blame everything on. One person in particular. Yukari's dad just happens to mention that he's gonna be the head researcher. For Masiru's group. Hmm. I can only imagine as to who got blamed. I'll be starting on a big project soon, and I'm happy to be receiving so much recognition for my work. Oh, I wonder how that could only possibly go bad for you. But I swear to you that nothing is more important to me than you and your mother. Dad. Sounds like a good deal. Yukari, are you remembering to enjoy life? Are you still bright-eyed and hopeful, like you are now? No matter what happens in the next ten years, I hope you're happy. Well, I hope this letter brings a smile to your face. Love, Dad. No matter what happens, huh? I can't lose hope. For his sake. There you go, you guy. I won't turn my back. I won't be like mom. Ooh. Oh man, the drop. Not ever. Ooh. Exams are coming up. Well, that's... It's Sunday. Oh, well, we can hit up Tanaka real quick. What have you got today, Tanaka? Max safety shoes. Great. And two tricksters. Well, I got plenty of money, and I have to imagine that's halfway decent. At the very least, the uh, items he gave me were like halfway decent when we originally used them, though that was more or less at the beginning of the game. Next time we'll have some stylish and dashing Japanese attire perfect for the season. Oh, you know, we gotta hit up the next one. Alright, so we can study, we can, we can play with Maya, we can go outside. I don't think I, I don't have any affirmance on me is the thing, so the, uh, the social link won't go up very much. It might go up once because I think we're only, what, like rank 2 or something? Rank 3? Eh, may or may not at that point. Uh, no. I don't have any hero flop for shows at the moment, so it feels like it'd make more sense to go out and try and find somebody that way. Dude, don't bother me, I'm studying here, dude. I don't get good grades as easily as you do, buddy. Later. Okay, dude, hey, jeez. Calm down, dude. I ask you questions. Is there something you believe in? Something that even when everything is terrible, you. And you've been betrayed by everyone. Is there something you can still believe in? Of course there isn't. I don't know. They're very strong. I wish I was like you. I don't know. Sorry. There's no way you could answer a question like that, huh? There is. Yeah, it's a hard thing to find. Sir, I didn't mean the high day. I told you. I told you what you need to know and omitted the necessary details. I should stop this. Hiding behind this door and claiming I'm not hiding anything. I was. I was hiding it. Um, 
Do we have any recordings as a result of all that? No new recordings. Well, okay, well. Alright, so everybody's in here because they're studying for the exams. The question is, do we need to study? I mean, we're at four, right? Surely that'd be good enough. I don't think we got the Tartars today. Everyone seems to be studying. I mean, I haven't seen anyone around, so they must be studying, right? Right. Okay, good. So then when the exams are over, everything will go back to normal. Aw, poor Fuka. I'm not sure. Yeah, neither am I. Maybe they're not just studying. Certain on the TV, Featherman are trash monster on the mood. Don't later, kids. And now the news. <sighs> study, study, go out, study or go out. We should probably go. I mean, we're great for studying. Surely that should be enough for finals, right? Right? I mean, it says we're smart. <laughs> Although we should probably check what we can do on Sunday at the very least. The old couple we can do, Jerry and people, no. Uh, Kermit we can do. Art Club, no. You're at the Shrine, no. Uh, the Mysterious Guy we can't do, baby, no, Gourmet King. So it's pretty much Gourmet King, the old couple. Or there was another dude that we could meet at the Shrine, but maybe he was only Sunday? I don't remember, which if that's the case, we can go ahead and check that real quick. Is it Sunday? It is! I think we had to be smart to talk to him, too. We're actually smart now. Your eyes are so clear. Your soul must be burning brightly. The young man must be intrigued by you because of your impressive academics. Ah, of course, because when you first look at a person, surely you're like, hmm, that's some impressive academics right there. <laughs> The me that I see reflected in your eyes, and the real me is, that if there is such a thing, how far apart are they? Almost zero, you get hit on the head, three light years. Almost zero, that works. The thin young man seems happy for some reason. Your words are very beautiful. If I had something to write with, I'd write them down. I have a fountain pen, it uses red ink, blood red. My f my pen is my supporter, my spokesman, and my friend, whoever it seems to have disappeared. Without it, my screams are silenced. The young man seems sad. Apparently his fountain pen is missing. I'm looking for my fountain pen. If, please tell me if you find it. Perhaps the creature with white fur and bright red eyes kidnapped it. Apparently the young man's fountain pen is missing. Well, that would seem to suggest that poor Maru has it. No, I don't think we've actually seen Kaoru Maru out. So I'm not really sure what that's on. Join your hands? No, that's off the Tory box. Well, I guess we can look her out for Colt or Maru. At the very least, I can feed the cat a little bit more. Do I say anything new? I got a complaint from the fair. The guy called me. Resia on sociable and moody, but when I tried to talk, they told me to show up. This job, I tell you. Well, yeah. Sounds like service jobs. First term is finally over. I never, I never felt this long when I was in fifth grade, but this one seemed to go on forever. It's all in your mind. It's not just me. The other kids in my class think so too. The class next door gets to go out and play with their teacher, but ours just stares out the window. Rip. Any of you guys got a pet? It probably means that I can't actually do his until Koromaru becomes a thing. I don't suppose you would have gone in now. Come on, looks a bit. Uh, you still weak cat over here? Well, we still got more cat for you. His eyes are more open now. If you come back and feed it some more, it might get healthy. Are you kidding me? I don't even know how much more cat food I have. I imagine I have at least a little bit more. Yeah, they're all still saying the same thing. Okay. Well, I guess we could check around the mall then on the off chance somebody has a fever, though I don't know why. 
That's the Jack Frost doll. Don't believe we actually need that anymore. Yeah, we know what the mall's called that. I get tired of coming up with new things to put into my son's lunch. My family always complains when I give them the same dish, so I'm always looking for something new. My friend told me about her kid at GeckoCon who ordered a pork chop sandwich from the student shop. He complained about the pork chop in it, of all things, so she got angry at him. She told him if you don't like the meat, order sweet pastries or tri-colored cake bread from now on. Yeah, that seems about right. Alright, we can hang out with Nozomi. We can get different stats. Or we can hang out with the old couple. Well, uh, Nozomi gives me the best, more or less, stat. And the fact that I can get the social link up and make our moon archon is better. Perfect time. You want to go eat some? You want to go get something? But yeah, I can hear my poor stomach crying sad. Sure. Uh, the familiar fish smell fills the restaurant. You and Nozomi ate the past the time. Seven, eight, nine. Crap, I must have counted wrong before. I'm one person short. Well, they can't make a fool out of me. I'm not going to lose my brother again. Nozomi began eating with a band. Hold on, I think. Oh, boy. Nozomi ran into the restaurant. Ever see that movie where the thing comes out of the guy's chest? Come on, it's your job to laugh at the Gourmet King's dumb jokes. I don't get it. I feel fine up until just a moment ago. Does this happen often? Ate too much, huh? Are you feeling sick? Uh, ate too much? You know, he's gonna be like, nah, are you feeling sick? Uh, I mean, that at least shows like some little concern for him, but he might get mad at it. He'll probably just be like, nah, it's probably like the safe answer. Does this happen often? It also shows concern as well. Uh, but he also. Yeah, this is happening. Yeah, it seems like every once in a while my body wants to uh, rewind the meal. Alright, well, you know, it, I feel like it was either the top or the bottom there. Don't worry about me, I consider things like this trials, that's all. You have to undergo certain hardships if you want to become worthy to enter the paradise. But you consider uh, trying to enter the paradise too. Alright. I think I'm gonna need a little more of a definition of what the uh, <laughs> the paradise is. Noodles don't taste so great after a week. Rewind, do they? I'll have to tell you all about the paradise next time. As for today, why don't we focus on the ramen blessed bananas? In fact, I think a big bowl of porridge might do me good. Waiter, how about some of your flights? Hi, how was your day? It was uh, an interesting day, Fuku, but you're here, so, you know, it makes a little bit better. Yeah, 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 right. Alright, so it's probably gonna end up being finals after I switch the day here, so we'll go ahead and save it for this episode. Uh, now that we found out that Mitsuru, well, I guess she it was 10 years ago, so she wasn't necessarily more involved in the process. But we know that they were experimenting in GekuCon using all the shadows uh, to get some sort of power. Which I'm not really sure how they were able to necessarily contain shadows if they didn't have personas. Although I guess it said uh, Mitsuru was forced to obtain one, which presumably means they were able to do with others within the group itself. In which case, maybe then they use that as the ability to uh, contain them like they were talking about. In which case, maybe. It also sounds like uh, Yukari's dad was more than likely the one who took all the blame for when the experiment failed and scattered the giant shadow into the 12 shadows that did now that we fight during the full moons. So it makes sense why Yukari would be so aggressive towards Mitsuru in that pursuit, which, uh, fair enough. Especially if she believes it to be that uh, it ended up uh, getting rid of her dad, which could very well be the thing. I mean, we don't know how many people potentially lived and or uh, died as a result of that, so 
And I'm sure as we get farther into the game, more of that will show up. But uh, yeah, that's about it for this episode. Appreciate you guys for watching, and we will go ahead and see you guys in the next one. See ya.